Um, our topic for today is about household quadratic equation using the zero property. It's a simple topic. Before I want to tell you what is this property. This property, uh, zero property, uh, says um, the zero product. property states that for all real numbers there's A uh, or B If a b equals zero, then eight is equal zero or b equals zero. So that's the zero product property. Uh huh. We have this example here. Solve for x, um, x plus 3 times x minus 2 equals 0. According to the zero property, if x, if x plus 3 um, times x minus 2 equals 0, then uh, x. Uh, x plus 3 must be a uh, 0 or x uh, minus 2 equals 0. So write the question. Write the question. and solve for x. We have to solve for, for x. So then we are gonna have here x plus three equals zero or x minus two equals uh, zero. See? Uh, this is addition, this, this says the three is adding, so you change the other size, it's gonna be as, as a subtraction. So here is going to be x equals negative 3. See, you move to the other side. Here, it says it's a subtraction. You move to the other side, just addition. So it's going to be uh, like this, too. So the solution, the solution is, is x equals negative 3 or x equals 2. See, this is our solution for this um, uh, quadratic equation using the zero property, the zero product pro property, okay? Let's see another example. Let me write another problem, another simple problem. In this case, I solve for t. Uh, let's write t uh, minus 4 times t minus 2. Uh, I mean, mm, let's see, minus eight equals zero, see? According to the zero product property, uh, here uh, x, no, t plus t minus four, t minus four must be, must be zero, or, or, uh, t minus 8, t minus 8 uh, must be, be 0, see? So, um, you write the, the problem, it's very simple, you will have to uh, um, make a complex process, just write a t here, you have um, t minus 8, t minus 4 first, t minus 4 equals 0, or t 
minus a equals zero. See, very simple, but it's not that hard. So here is going to be t equals four positive. Here is negative, the other side is positive. Here is negative eight, you move to the other side, it's going to be positive. So this is the answer. So the solution is t equals four or t equals eight. So this is the way to find the answer uh, of the quadrat equation using the zero product property. Very simple. So this class is for algebra one. Thank you so much.